In the elderly, vision impairment is the most common form of disability. Vision impairment restricts routine activity, hampering daily living skills and increasing the risk of falling and injuring oneself. Vision loss is common in elderly populations. A large proportion of this vision loss is avoidable. That is, it is either preventable, treatable or correctable with a simple pair of glasses or cataract surgery. Ironically, the research on eye health in elderly is still in stage of infancy in India. The research on comprehensive health assessment in elderly is significant and highly relevant at this point in time. We wanted to find out how those who live in residential care, that is, in homes for the aged, manage with poor vision in their advancing years. So, in 2017, the LV Prasad Eye Institute launched the Hyderabad Ocular Morbidity in Elderly study, abbreviated as HOMES, a two-phase study in Hyderabad, the capital of Telangana and Andhra Pradesh states. First, trained social investigators interviewed participants and collected information on their general health, visual functioning, levels of depression, fears about falling down and grievously injuring themselves. <laughs> Next, the eye examinations were conducted in makeshift eye clinics on the premises. The comprehensive eye examination included fundus imaging and was performed by a trained clinician. Those who required glasses were provided these at no charge to them right at their doorstep. Those needing additional care were referred to LV Prasad Eye Institute's Kallam Anji Reddy campus in Hyderabad Kanlagurinchi Chala Ibandunde, Sarika Kanabadago Poyedi, China Chalodanki Bandayedi, either Napanula Laguda Ibandunde, either Chedaniki, Sarika, Biam Layamana, Sinachina Pudul Layamana, Sarika Kanabada, to Chala Bagunadi, Manchiga, Susco Galutana, Chaduko Galutana, Sinachin Akshar Alguda, Kanabatane, Kanabadago Poyedi, Manchiganavatan. Over 1,000 elders in 26 residential care centers participated in Homes Phase 1. We found that of every four elderly persons living in residential care, one deals with vision loss. Over 80% of this vision loss is either due to refractive errors or cataract. As part of HOMES Phase 2, the impact of interventions is being assessed. Does wearing glasses or undergoing a cataract operation affect an individual's visual functioning? What is their perceived level of depression or frequency of falling down due to poor vision? The findings from homes will allow us to evolve strategies to better assess eye health in the elderly and reduce their vision loss. The big picture goal of this project is provide data so that we can formulate strategies to address uh, vision loss in elderly in residential care. Currently, there are no established protocols and we believe that our study will provide uh, valuable insights on development of these protocols. My application I interviewed. In future, we plan to study the eye health of our geriatric population in rural areas wherever the LV Prasad Eye Institute has a presence. It is said that 70% of our routines are vision related. Protecting one's vision until the end of one's life is a big responsibility, one that the LV Prasad Eye Institute eagerly shares with our elders.
After all, healthy aging is happy aging.